Hey guys, it's Handy, and um, I don't know what we're in for. I'm just gonna say this right now. Uh, we're about to play a game called Honey Pop. It's a game. Um, uh, it's it's a it's a puzzle dating sim uh, where you get to meet these ladies and try to date them. Uh, and I've I've never really played a game like this. I mean, I played like Leisure Suit Larry when I hit puberty, but like this is I've this is a whole new level for me. Um, I don't know what to expect. Uh, I've not actually seen any videos on YouTube uh, for this uh, game series, but I do know this: it's so lewd and graphic that I'm not allowed to stream it on my Twitch channel. So this is exclusive uh, for YouTube, and I hope you guys enjoy this. And uh, let's just get right into it, man. I honestly I don't know what to expect. Uh, we're gonna play as a male. Honey Pop. <laughs> Sunday night, the bar and lounge. Hi there. Hi. Wow, okay. Could I get you to maybe take it down a notch? I'm right here. <laughs> sure. I know, right? It's crazy. <laughs> My name is Q. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Nope, not like that at all. Look, dude, are you gonna be alright? Looks like you're having some trouble holding it together over there. <laughs> That's a fat load of shit and you know it. What? I could see how uncomfortable you are right now from space. I don't really like the the what? options. You know what? This might actually work. Yeah. Yeah. Oh man, this is your lucky day, buddy. Is it? Listen, I gotta go, but we'll meet again real soon. Trust me. Night. Night. Shout out to our uh, good buddy Oz Mortal. This was a gift from him for my birthday. Uh, as I'm recording this, my birthday's tomorrow, but. Um, Hey, Thank you, you Osmortal. Shout out, my friend. All right, rise and shine. I said, get up. I'm up. I bet you were. Afraid not. This is totally happening. Don't you recognize this adorable face? <laughs> it's Kiyu from the bar. Clever disguise, right? I can change my hair any color I want. It's pretty sweet. If you can't tell by now, I'm a fairy. Well, a love fairy to be exact. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, funny. But let's leave the sarcasm to me, all right? Oh, see, shots fired, Q. Fairy, it's my job to help poor saps like you out with the ladies. It's just mm, what I do. I don't like to brag, but I'll have you know I have a very impressive track record. I don't like to brag. I don't like to boast. Basically walking babe magnets now. But I'm like hot butter on your breakfast <laughs> toast, gal. What's up, Q? Let's just say you will be my greatest accomplishment yet. Sure. Uh, I don't. I mean, these, all of these options are stupid. Man, you and all the questions. Can't a fairy just help a brother out? Sure. We need to get started right away. Tell me, how many dates have you been on? This week? Oh my god, it's worse than I thought, isn't it? All right, grab your shit. We're going on a date right now. So again, this is a place. dating sim. I know a place nearby that's open pretty late. You'll love it. Or not, I don't care. I don't really like the options for the answers. I just think like they're totally like the most loser dudes on the planet. Alright, so now we're into the puzzle right. aspect? I'll try to make this click. This is the date grid. These little pieces are called tokens. You earn affection by matching three or more of the circular tokens horizontally or vertically. For a successful date, you have to fill the affection meter before you run out of moves. Go ahead, give it a shot. Match those orange ones with the crescent shape in the oh. middle of the grid. Yeah, yeah. 
Oh, it's a pole. Okay. See? Easy. Each of the four types of affection tokens represents a here, particular trait. Here. The orange ones represent romance. Blue is talent. Green is flirtation. And red is sexuality. Pay attention to which trait your date prefers. It'll go a long way. Huh. Of course, matching four or five tokens will get you even more affection. Okay. I'll show you. Match those four sexuality tokens in the bottom right of the grid. The red one. Oh, you can pull them! Oh! Okay, what's next? Oh, right! Let me cover the other token types real quick. The pink hearts are passion tokens. Matching those will raise your date's passion level. The higher her passion level is, the more affection you'll earn. Okay. The gold bells are joy tokens. You'll get an extra move by matching those. Okay. Very useful. The broken heart tokens are bad news. Seriously, avoid matching those as best you can. Finally, the teardrops are sentiment tokens. Matching those gives you, well, sentiment. You need sentiment in order to use date gifts. And seeing as how you don't have any date gifts, I'm guessing I need to explain that too. Here, I'll hook you up with one of mine. It's on the house. Like I said, you'll need sentiment to use it. So go ahead and match those three sentiment tokens in the leftmost column, the teardrops. Okay, now go ahead and give that date gift to me. Cool, huh? There are like a ton of different date gifts that you can get too. They each have a unique effect on the date and can be extremely useful in combination. Oh, <laughs> and thanks to a little fairy magic, you'll never actually lose them. So you can use them on your next date, too. <laughs> Is that cool or what? All right, all right, I've cool. gone on long enough. I'll let you finish up the date so you can get the hang of it. Oh, and don't worry, I won't let you fail this one. I'm not that mean. So you can only go horizontal or vertical. That's cool. All right, some music tokens. We got a four right there. Uh, I'm getting the hang of this. This is like uh, like a Candy Crush or something like that. Just like easier. I guess you really do want to get your date, right? Oh, the combo smash. Um, all right, don't no, we don't want the broken hearts? Okay. Mm oh, we can do that one. All right, and uh, we can do. Oh, there we go. There we go. Here we go, yo. Here we go, yo. So what? So what? What's your scenario? Uh, there we go. Let's do this, and we'll do this, and uh, let's see. We're almost there, man. Uh, Ninety-seven of a hundred. A hundred of a hundred. Boom! Success. Success. Morning already? We are way behind schedule. Okay, check it out. I have one last thing to give you, and this is important. Introducing the latest in Love Fairy technology, the Honeybee 4.0. The Honeybee is an essential lifeline for any player on the go. It automatically registers the info of new girls you meet and can even track their location. You can organize your inventory, buy new gifts, upgrade your traits, it's awesome. We don't have time to go over every feature, but you're a big boy. You can figure it out. To access the honeybee, all you have to do is right click at pretty much any time. Or if you're weird, you can use that button at the top of the screen. Go ahead, break that bad boy open. T 
Tissue box. Special item used for wiping your nose or cleaning up other various bodily fluids. Wow. Dirty magazine. Special item. Reading material that you only look at for the interesting articles. Wow. Okay, great. I think that's it for now. Wow. Let's get out there and talk to some broads. Some broads? I said, let's go talk to some broads. You know what? Uh, I think this is taking us into the game. So let's just end it here on the tutorial. Uh, so thank you so much for watching part one of Honey Pop. We're about to meet some broads, yeah! Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. A big shout out to our buddy, uh, twitch.tv slash Ozmortal uh, for, for the gift for our birthday of Honey Pop, which we will be exclusively streaming, or not streaming, uh, recording here for YouTube. This is funny, this is a great game. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. You guys will be back with more. The Lewd Continues.